I'm Portia Williams, and I'm best known for being a part of the cast for Real Housewives of Atlanta, as well as uh, Dish Nation. I really wanted to be a part of Celebrity Apprentice um, because Celebrity Apprentice is business-based. Um, it's a great opportunity for me to show a different side of who I am, you know, I'm kind of fun and entertaining on Housewives, which is awesome, uh, Dish Nation, clever witty reporting on everybody else's business. Um, but this one is based on, you know, my background as far as being an entrepreneur. and. The biggest aspect of the show is giving back and charity. And so my family, we have a charity and it's called Hosea Feed the Hungry and Homeless. And I'm really excited to be able to bring awareness to it on this type of platform and raise money for them. It's gonna be amazing. You know, it's a lot of people in need right here in our own backyard. And you know, what better way for me to be here on a show like this and this big production and the dollars that I am able to bring towards the charity can put food in a child's mouth. Well, you know, I have a long history as far as working for myself. Um, even when I was as young as 10 years old, you know, we had the candy lady in the neighborhood and I was like, why should she get the money? Let me start a candy uh, store or whatever. And I set up the store, had my mom go to Sam's Club and get everything. I had cameras and everything, you know, so at a young age, I knew I wanted to make my own money. Um, at the age of 24, I followed in the footsteps of my mother who had a child care center all my life. And so at 24, I bought my first child care center and I ran that successfully until uh, I got married. And currently, I run two companies, uh, Go Naked Hair and Go Naked, I'm sorry, and Naked Lingerie Boutique. Um, so I believe that my strengths, well, let me say, I'll probably have the upper hand because a lot of the people on the cast are probably relating me to the character from Housewives and that shows some business, but mostly relationships with the other women is what it kind of showcases. Um, but I don't think they're as aware that I'm a businesswoman and that you know I'm great at strategizing um, plans for marketing and all of that. It's something I really like to do. And I think that this type of show, again, with it being based in charity, the passion will be there. I mean, we're gonna go really hard. It's a lot of athletes on this show, so you know they're competitive. Um, I also used to be in sales. So anybody in sales, it's like, it's hard for, you know, when somebody sells me something, I buy it quick. But for me, when I'm selling to someone, I go hard. And so I'm gonna have all these brands, you know, listening to my plan and, you know, as far as being a leader of these different teams, I think that's gonna be awesome as well, get the opportunity to show that. And I just think it's gonna be a good time. What I'm doing right now, I'm just sitting back watching everybody. And you know, the people who are out there with the personality, they kind of tell you what they're up to, they tell you what their game plan is. I'm really looking uh, for the biggest person to be the competition is the one who's gonna be quiet because they're sitting back and they're just trying to see, you know, how the game should be played. They're thinking about each character. They're probably researching everybody's background, who's strong or whose strength is this in business, who has that strength in that business. Um, so I haven't figured out exactly who that is because it's kind of the first day, but I'll definitely have my eye out for the one who's quiet. When I found out that Arnold Schwarzenegger himself was going to be the chairman of the board for this show and he is who I will face in the boardroom, I was stunned. Like that is the most intimidating feeling ever. But meeting him, he has such a personality, um, surprising sense of humor, you know, so he kind of relaxes you a bit. Um, but I don't want that to throw me off. You know, Arnold Schwarzenegger is very accomplished business-wise. Um, you know, he was in real estate, made his first million before he even stepped into the entertainment realm. So for me, you know, I admire his business sense and I want to impress him. And, um, you know, I really want to be able to make an impression each time I'm in the boardroom. And I want to be honest. I don't want to be the type of contestant like I've seen in the past, to, you know, have to throw people under, under the bus. I just, when I say honest, I want to be the type of person to say, hey, if you haven't done something, I'm just mentioning it. I'm not telling on anybody. It's all business. It's not personal. It's kind of the model that I have in my mind right now. You know, with the show being based in LA now, as opposed to New York, uh, first of all, wardrobe-wise, I'm thinking, oh, I can, you know, have my fur, this, that. 
faux fur, all that, this, that. But, um, you know, here it's a little more laid back, you know? So I'm gonna have to be self-motivating to pick up the pace because here I just feel like, you know, it's just easy going and cool. Um, I do think that this season here in LA is gonna be super exciting, completely different atmosphere. It's gonna be bright. It's gonna be um, with, Arnold Schwarzenegger, it's gonna be a lot of action, I'm thinking. We're gonna be very active this season. Um, it's just gonna to be totally different. It's not gonna be cold, it's gonna be warm. And um, I think that we're gonna work with a lot of fun brands um, and have a lot of opportunities to come up with some good plans and marketing schemes for a lot of the fun brands here in LA. Arnold Schwarzenegger let us know that he will run the show how he sees fit. He's going to bring his personality. Um, so therefore, it's going to reflect things that he enjoys. He enjoys business, entertainment, um, and, and that's going to be a lot of what's going to happen.